Well, we all agree. We're in a bad way these days. We got babies in cages. The government shut down. Our homeless population has exploded. It's even been suggested that teachers should be armed at work. And it's so easy to blame this guy. But single-payer health care in California and the Green New Deal nationally were blocked not by Trump and his cronies, but by Democrats. And guys with friends like these, who needs Republicans? So let's learn together how the Democratic Party operates. Here in California, the Democratic Party is ruled by the votes of delegates. And one third of that voting body of delegates is made up by our own elected officials. The second third of the voting body of delegates get appointed by our elected officials. These are mostly paid staffers and other yes people. The final third of the delegate body is made up of folks who are elected from the grassroots. The folks who are doing the actual hard work in our communities. These are the activists. These are our neighbors and our families, our teachers, our nurses, real people, not paid staffers, not yes folks. The idea is that we are the people who keep the Democratic Party honest. And it would be a real shame to let that get lost in an election that most folks don't even know about. Sadly, our elected officials, in spite of their getting to appoint yes people to the appointed third, still try to influence the elections around our grassroots elected delegates. It's extremely disingenuous. Our elected officials create slates of paid staffers and yes people just to make sure those seats are taken away from grassroots activists, lending them additional influence and additional delegate votes. So the rational person asks, why not just have awesome grassroots folks run for those spots, right? Well, the largely unpublicized elections happen in January every two years. People don't know about it. It's a dirty secret. So this January, registered Democrats have the opportunity to exert some real influence over what the California Democratic Party actually does over platform over endorsements, over everything that influences the Democratic Party. You have that opportunity. Please come out and vote for real progressives because this is shit. And we have an avenue to make it better. We just have to take advantage. So please come out. Please vote. Please vote for real progressives.